Have you ever wondered what our world would be like if everything was? Grr. I'm not talking about buildings or cars, but the creatures we share our planet with. Imagine a spider the size of a dinner plate, or a dragonfly with a wingspan like a hawk. It sounds like something out of a horror movie, right? But what if I told you that this terrifying world might have actually existed? Let's travel back in time, way back to the Carboniferous period, about 300 million years ago. This was an era unlike any other. The earth was covered in lush, swampy forests, but the most incredible thing was the air itself. The oxygen levels in the atmosphere were a staggering 35%, almost double the 21% we have today. This oxygen-rich environment had a dramatic effect on life. For insects, which breathe through tiny tubes in their bodies, this super-oxygenated air was like a superpower, allowed them to grow to monstrous sizes. We're talking about Arthropleura, a millipede-like creature that could grow over two meters long, scuttling across the forest floor. Or Meganeura, a dragonfly with a wingspan of 75 centimeters, making it the largest flying insect ever known. Imagine that, buzzing past your head. But it wasn't just insects. This period of high oxygen also fueled the evolution of larger, more powerful predators. These weren't just big, they were likely far more aggressive. More oxygen means a faster metabolism, more energy, and a greater need for fuel. This would have created a brutal, high-stakes world where everything was bigger, faster, and hungrier. The evidence for these ancient giants is written in the fossil record. We've found the remains of these colossal insects and other creatures. But what's truly chilling is what we might not have found yet. Recently, paleontologists uncovered a fossil of a claw 40 centimeters long. To put that in perspective, that's as long as your forearm. And the terrifying part? We have no idea what animal this massive claw belonged to. Does it match any known species? Could this be a remnant of an undiscovered super predator? A true monster forged in the high oxygen crucible of the Carboniferous? It makes you think about what other giants might be lurking in the rock waiting to be found. It's a humbling reminder that our planet has gone through extreme changes, and the life it supported was sometimes the stuff of nightmares. So next time you see a tiny spider, just be glad you don't live in a world with 35% oxygen. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this journey into our planet's monstrous past, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more mind-blowing stories.